morning, dear students. Owing to the COVID-19 pandemic, Martha Meyer Secondary School Indoor takes pleasure of commencing the online classes for you. The lockdown situation has had an adverse impact on teaching learning process. So without ampering it further, let's begin our online classes for your academic benefit. You are advised to revise the content thoroughly and solve the worksheet provided properly. Dear students, as it is written in the Holy Scripture, he who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say to the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him I will trust. Surely He will save you from the fall of our snare and from the deadly pestilence. I convey my best wishes and prayer for the upcoming session. Dear students, Take care of your health and stay safe. May God bless us all. Thank you. Hi students, I am Sundar Vijayakuma of Bhatama Higher Secondary School and I am taking science for your fifth class. Okay? Before going to the topic, let me talk about the important thing which is needed for all the existence of life. Okay? We all living beings are dependent on food and water. We all know that we cannot live without food and water. So that is what I am going to speak about. Okay students, you all are eating food. You don't know what food you are consuming. You are taking it in the breakfast, you are taking it in the lunch and dinner. But you should know what are nutrition. It is an important substance which is present in all types of food. So mainly there are five important nutrients. What are they? Yes, we will start with carbohydrate, proteins, vitamins, minerals and last fats which we have to consume a little amount only. Ok children? Cha, come on. Before taking to this pyramid, food pyramid, we will talk about balance diet. Ok? Now, what is the definition of balanced diet? Yes, the diet containing right amount of nutrients. Yes, whatever amount of food you are consuming, you should have a balance for that. Ok? It should contain all the five nutrients in a correct amount. That is what is the meaning right amount. Ok children? Now these are the nutrients. Why I have drawn this food pyramid? Do you know what is the speciality of this pyramid? Yes, you can see the bottom portion. It is very much broader. Ok? And when we are moving to the upper portion, this becomes narrow. That means we have to consume broad things in the bottom side and least amount of food at the home, that is the upper side of the pyramid. Now what are the things which we have to consume as nutrients? Very good children, the first thing it is the carbohydrates. Do you know carbohydrate is having another nickname? What is it? Energy giving food. And what are the foods? With which we can gain the energy? Rice, wheat, bread, potato, porridge. Okay, if you are taking all these foods in a large amount in your daily diet, then you will have more energy to do the work. These are mainly for the growing children because they are all always going on for playing, reading, writing. And for the people, those who are doing more physical work. Next comes up vitamins and minerals. Now, this pyramid is becoming a little bit narrower. Okay? Now, what are the things we have to take to get vitamins and minerals? Yes, vegetables, spinach, cabbage, tomato, brinjal, carrot, with the fruits also. Banana, apple, grapes. There are many other fruits also. Now, why we are calling it as another nickname also, vitamins and minerals are having, that is protective food. 
Why? Because if you are taking the correct amount of vegetables and fruits, then you can protect your body from different kinds of diseases. Okay? Next, our portion reaches to the nutrient called proteins. Now, what are the food items of proteins? Yes, milk, egg, all the milk products like cheese, fish, pulses. Okay? If you are consuming these foods, then your body will be having a nice muscle. You can build up your body, which is very much needed during this pandemic season. Okay? The last thing we have to take very, very less amount during our diet. What is that? Fats. The name itself makes you understand that if you are taking much more of fatty foods like ice cream, chips, chocolates, then you will get your size a lot bigger. Then you, will, you may have the disease like obesity. So children, if you understand what are the five important nutrients and what are the foods which contain all these nutrients. Okay? We will just revise it with our palm. You all might have this palm. We are having five fingers. How can you remember the nutrition? See, which is the longest finger in this? The middle finger. So we have to consume more amount of energy giving food. That is the carbohydrates. So we will consider this as the carbohydrates. Okay children? Now our index finger and the ring finger. They both are having the same size. So we will consider these two fingers as vitamins and minerals. Okay? Now look at the size. It's somewhat thicker than this one. So this we will take as fats. Okay? And we have to contain, con we have to eat less amount of fatty foods. Okay? And this little finger joins all the nutrients. Now this is what you have to remember while taking food. Thank you. Hope you understood the chapter. Till then, take rest and be safe.